I was always able to uh, to draw or create whatever I wanted as a kid, but I didn't even get into art until I was 19 years old, and I was through graffiti. Well, when I started painting in the 89 in Vancouver, you know, there were probably a couple dozen graffiti writers in the city. And to us, skill was important. And uh, there were some guys who were very traditional and they wanted to stick with the whole hip hop thing, right? And then there were other guys like me who, who were really trying to go outside the envelope. And um, it was, the bottom line was we're all trying to do these incredible paintings. You know, I remember skateboard and graffiti culture because I was immersed in it. The graffiti-based stuff, which has definitely been taken in a direction that is truly, uh, you know, outside the box, you know, beyond what graffiti writers were, were thinking of, you know, and it's great because, you know, you can't do the same thing all the time. You need to pioneer, you know, you gotta be a trailblazer, make up your own thing.